Hello and welcome back to Podcast Like a Pro. Today we're going to dig into recording our first audio segments using the free open source tool called Audacity. So let's dive right in. I'm going to go ahead and open up Audacity and we'll dig into exactly how it works and how to record audio. Okay, here we are inside Audacity. You can see this is kind of a blank screen, right? And so the first thing to mention is you have the ability to control which microphone you're using as the input. We talked about volume monitoring before, and this is kind of the key beginning part of that is you want to make sure that not your built-in microphone for your computer, or I have a webcam connected also, neither of those are connected, but the, the podcasting mic that you have bought and connected to your computer is the one that's showing up here. Okay, uh, as a side note, if you don't have the Podca your podcasting mic plugged in when you open Audacity, it may require you to restart Audacity and then select the mic. It might not show up here if you don't have it plugged in. Okay, so then the next thing to, to look at is the volume control here. So uh, I have my volume turned all the way up as the input for, for when I'm recording here, and we'll see the volume meters here in just a bit up here when I start recording uh, that they should be kind of calibrated correctly, and if not, then we'll make an adjustment in the volume indicator here. So to record a track with Audacity, it's real easy. You just hit the big red record button here, and you can see that it's it starts recording me and the things that I'm saying. So hey, welcome to the Podcast Motor Show. My name is Craig Hewitt. Really excited to have you here. We're going to dig into some great stuff today with Audacity. Right, and that's it. And so you can see, I'll go ahead and hit stop here. But you can see the waveforms here sort of graphically representing what you're seeing. Um, and, and we saw with the volume monitoring that it was coming all the way up green, a little bit of yellow, and just touching red every once in a while. And that's just fine. That's kind of exactly what we want. Okay, and if we go back to the beginning here, you can either uh, just click with your mouse up here and it'll we'll start hearing what we were recording before. The record button here. And you can see that it's it starts recording me and the things that I'm saying. So. So notice the volume meter up here is is good, good to on the low Starts side, recording me and the things that I'm saying. So hey, welcome to the Podcast Motor Show. My name is Craig Hewitt. Really excited to have you here. We're going to dig into some great stuff today with Audacity. So you want kind of minus three as the top end of your vocal range. So uh, I think my input settings are correct. I have the volume turned all the way up, which is how it should be. I'm situated with the mic about at my mouth level, slightly down. Um, and it's about a fist width apart with the pop filter between me and the microphone. Uh, and so I'd consider this to be a good sample of, of audio for me to record. Uh, we'll listen to it again and see if there's anything that jumps out at us. I'd record button here, and you can see that it's it starts recording me and the things that I'm saying. So hey, welcome to the Podcast Motor Show. My name is Craig Hewitt. Really excited to have you here. We're going to dig into some great stuff today with Audacity. Right, and that's it. And so you can see... Yeah, so I think that's a great start. There's nothing I would change about how I'm recording here. We're going to dig into all the rest of the functionality here in terms of audio editing later on. But as far as recording your first bit with Audacity, that's the basics. We're going to go into something different here with recording a second track. So say uh, you, you want to record something on top of a voiceover or say you have some music in there. How do you record something on top of that? Uh, with Audacity, it's simple. If you have the first track in here already, just hit record again. It opens up a second track, and you can start recording that second track down here separate from the first one. And I'll go ahead and hit stop, and you'll see it sounds... I'll go ahead and hit stop again. It opens up a second track. It sounds seamless, and so you can use uh, a couple of these editing tools, and we'll dig into this more in detail later to sort of align the tracks properly, or if you want to cut part of one out, just click and highlight it, and then click delete on your keyboard and it only affects this track and this track stays separate so you're editing them totally independently again we're going to go into this a lot more detail in the editing section as well but just as a beginning if you want to trim off the end of a bit just highlight it with the selector tool here and hit delete uh, okay so that wraps up recording basic audio with audacity uh, if you have any questions let us know in the comments below